Tyler, thanks for joining us here. We appreciate it. Uh, I want to start with uh, University of Michigan. Coming off a great year with the Wolverines, 32 goals, Hobie Baker finalists. You guys got knocked off by a really good North Dakota team that ended up winning the national championship. But I imagine it was a pretty special year for you. Yeah, absolutely. I enjoyed every second of it. Um, played with a lot of great line mates, great teammates, great staff. Um, overall, it was a great experience. Um, tough way to go out um, to come with a couple of our teammates out here now. But probably the best team I played in my three years there, and they deserved it. Now you mentioned your two line mates there. You guys finished as three of the top four point scorers in all of the NCAA. Was the chemistry, was it instant, or did it take a little while for you guys to all gel? No, I think we just hopped right in and played well together. Um, where we were all knowledgeable players, and we all played the game a little different way, but it kind of just seemed to click, like you said. Um, we just had fun with it. We didn't question too many things. We just went out there, played our game. Um, Pucks seemed to find each other's tape, and we managed to produce quite a bit. And you signed pretty quickly with Chicago in April, not too long after the season wrapped up. Um, was that an easy decision? It seemed like a quick one. Was it, was it an easy one or something you had kind of had in mind for a while? It's something you always think about uh, throughout the year. You try and push it to the back of your mind, um, but it kind of keeps slipping back up. But it was a tough decision to definitely leave the University of Michigan. Um, I loved my three years there. I'll cherish every moment of it. Um, but it was just the right time and the right opportunity um, here in the near future. Um, the opportunities a lot of young guys are going to get, um, it was tough to pass up. And you jumped right into professional hockey, playing a few games with the Ice Hogs in Rockford, both regular season and playoffs. How valuable was that experience to jump right into professional hockey? Right, after kind of making up my mind uh, to sign, I figured to get a little bit of experience uh, with professional hockey was the right way to go. Um, grabbed eight games there in Rockford, five regular season, and then the three playoff games. Um, I just, just to get used to kind of the, the pro lifestyle and the way things run um, in a professional atmosphere is definitely um, something I think was definitely worth it. What are the biggest differences on the ice and off the ice jumping from the NCAA to the AHL? I think away from the rink is the biggest difference. A lot more downtime. Um, everyone's a little bit more on their own, um, on their own schedule. Um, some guys got some wives and families. Um, so everyone's kind of a little bit different um, than the college lifestyle. Um, but at the rink, everyone's there to, it's more of a business mentality. Everyone's there to, to compete um, and get better and, and win for the organization.